What's up, guys? Let's explore the global tab. So the global tab uh, is basically well, what it is is it it it's really useful uh, in standalone mode because then you can set the BPM uh, to sync things in and accept MIDI clock and all that fun stuff and uh, global tune. So you can detune this uh, uh, the whole. Uh, plugin. So if you have multiple uh, massives open and you just want to detune one from another, uh, you can do that uh, right here and you can, you know, do that fun stuff. And always, you can always double click to go back to the default value. Um, the BPM is uh, set to host. So if I increase the BPM in Ableton, it increases here, which is of a nice kind of effect. Uh, and you can just turn off external sync and you can sync it to whatever the hell you want. Uh, BST magic. So this is so well. Yeah, we'll jump over to the right. So the the global quality high or ultra high in, uh, eco uh, eco. I think it's like e economical. So it's you know it runs it runs better. It's kind of, it's kind of like um, Diva's draft mode. So if your computer is getting bogged down by holy shit, I have eight hundred massives open. Set it to eco and but when it ren when it renders. It uh, it goes to um, it renders to ultra I would assume and ultra quality is for those with super cool uh, CPUs that you don't really need to worry about um, you know maxing out your CPU it's uh, massive is you know pretty well optimized for that sort of thing so uh, yeah this is the the fun part of massive I would say um, uh, once you know kind of what it does, this is like the randomized preset um, section. So what you do is you can just click and uh, randomize stuff. Hopefully, what did I do here? Oh yeah, you select what you want to randomize, and then it randomizes it. Sometimes it doesn't work. Ooh. You can set the amount that you want to randomize it. So I do not want to randomize a filter anymore, but not maybe not that. But maybe the uh, insert effects. So I'll randomize that. So I got pretty lucky, uh, but generally. You know, this is the randomized section. So, ra yeah, randomizing presets is pretty good, but it's the amount you want to kind of randomize. And you can, you know, copy cool stuff. Uh, and I guess you could keep OS pitch if you want. But, yeah, I pretty much got lucky and got something kind of cool right off the bat. So... Right. Uh, yeah. Generally, yeah, it's, it's mainly for you know quality settings, but you can select your quality setting up here, so you won't really use the the global uh, tab um, once you know you know what you're doing. But yeah, um, hope you learn stuff, and uh, yeah, we'll be back.